guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lisa. Lisa of your time. Let it be. Oh, let it be. If you're new here, make sure to go click the subscribe button and follow me on all of my social medias. Also, make sure to go turn on that notification bell because you wanna be notified whenever I post a new video. I post every Monday at 2 p.m. Eastern Time and every Saturday at 9 a.m. Eastern Time. So let's just jump into the video. I just got new glasses recently. <laughs> Found out that. So I got these glasses for $480. There was a small discount because I think the glasses are around 500 ish I'm not too sure. There was an added $100 for the UV protection and the light thing on the lens. So I think I'm going to get into the story time first and then I'm going to show you the really nice glasses because that's why I'm doing the story time to show off the nice ass glasses and just to unbox them and all because I literally, I've seen the inside but I have literally haven't picked it up and tried it on that much so I'm excited to do it in this video. I was shopping for new glasses with my mom. These are insurance for free. I got them last year in July. So my mom told me that I should get another pair of glasses because just in case these break and so I've been looking around for so long but I just haven't been able to find right ones and so I decided to bring my mom out because I'm the most indecisive person ever like I'm so bad at making decisions and so my mom came to the rescue and I'm literally so tired right now I'm filming like the fourth video and I just want to go to bed. We went to this one store and we just had terrible customer service. I got glasses one time from there, but like just on that day, all the store people were just ignoring us, didn't want to give us service and they were just all helping other people. So my mom and I just ended up leaving. I'm like, okay, let's just leave mom because my mom is a really impatient person when it comes to like getting service or whatever. And she's just like, just ask them, just keep on like asking them and all. She's not just like the kind of wait around person. She's like, ask, ask go talk to them or whatever and so we just ended up leaving and we went to this other store and I truly believe that everything honestly happens for a reason because we ended up at that other store which did have Tiffany glasses and I wouldn't have probably been able to get nice Tiffany glasses from the other store because I don't think they have any Tiffany brands and so we ended up at the other store and I spent some time looking around for different types of glasses and I especially, especially wanted another pair of glasses that had nose pads on them, right? Like these ones that I have here just have these things and I'll insert the nose pads that I'm talking about. Those ones that actually help you keep your glasses up because as you know, I'm Asian and I have basically a very flat nose. That nose bridge is not prominent, so of course my glasses like to fall down off my face so much. And a lot of the time, these glasses always end up sideways and it's hilarious. I love, love, love these plastic frames and the like, shape of these glasses and all, but the worst thing about them is that the nose pads aren't there and they really fall off my face a lot but life hack that my sister taught me was to bend these so that they can fit on your face better my little sister has glasses that are very much similar to mine and my older sister also wears glasses so as you can see we're all a family of very blind people Sorry, not trying to offend anyone. Majority of us are nearsighted, which means that we cannot see far away. I think all of us are nearsighted. Anyway, back to the story. So we spent a while trying to look around and all, and keep in mind that this second pair that I'm getting obviously is not insurance glasses, so we're gonna pick 
a pair of glasses and we're gonna pay for it and so I think we looked at like Bubberry or whatever I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right Bubberry <laughs> sorry they looked really nice they're like you know these shape I think mostly these type of glasses do not have those like nice looking nose pads usually the glasses that have like those nice nose pads that will hold up is like those metal glasses basically I'll insert pictures this lady was asking my mom what is the price range and all and my mom's like whatever my daughter likes is okay and so the lady eventually brings like a Tiffany glasses and there was a man that was helping me and then this lady was just like overhearing our conversation and just helping us I guess like she was another store person and she didn't have any other customer to deal with so she was helping me as well this pair of Tiffany glasses was so so pretty suited me so much I just kept on trying it on as soon as I saw the little cute jewels on the side I was just immediately sold I was like this is completely my personality this completely matches me it is so pretty and it has nose pads on it okay right it has the nose pads on it so I'm like this is the a hundred percent perfect pair of glasses for me hundred percent sure because there was nose pads on it it was like this is like the cherry on top I decided to get it my mom was like bargaining with them so much like please just get it a little bit lower get it a little bit lower you know asian parents or whatever because my mom is so used to bargaining this was in an asian store sales clerks and all were all asians eventually it just came down to 480 dollars i believe they told us they were like okay uh, so we're gonna give you a call tomorrow they gave us a little card and gave us the receipt i just had a way to come back tomorrow morning uh, to get it Flash forward to tomorrow, I had lunch at a Korean restaurant with like a couple of people from Life Camp and it was so nice going out with them. If any of you are watching this, it was so nice seeing you guys all again. I hope we can do it again. Anyway, after the lunch, I ended up just going to the glasses store. I think it was around 1-ish and I was waiting with a girl. She was the girl that went to the lunch with me. So one of the girls came, had to wait to get my glasses and the people at the store told me to just wait because they weren't done yet. And so I waited a little bit. And then eventually like the guy calls me to come over and I try it on and he's like, does it fit well? And I'm like, yeah, it really does. I go home. And I did not notice anything that was wrong in the store. I spent majority of the day outside and I was showing my glasses to the other people that went to the lunch with us after we met up because I was with another girl and then the two other people that I went to lunch with were at a different store and so when I met up with the two other people I showed one of the girls my glasses and still I didn't notice anything was wrong or out of the blue but when I went home that night I took out my glasses and I looked at them again and immediately I noticed that it did not have the nose pads that I wanted it had these type of stuff on it whatever they're called but they're not like legit nose pad nose pads that will just like rest and just like make your glasses not fall and I picked those glasses especially because they had nose pads and I was so so annoyed we ended up calling the people at the store my mom was just like kept on saying it doesn't have and basically we were like both thinking back to the day that i tried on those glasses and we both remembered that it had nose pads on it we swore we just kept on talking to the people but they just kept on denying it and it was later in the night it was around seven ish and they were like just come back tomorrow and you know whatever and then I was like, okay. And I remember I was just checking online and saw that the pictures of those glasses, the glasses that I got, 
did not have the nose pads that, that they had at the store. I ended up not going back to the store because honestly I was too lazy and my mom just told me to get over it, whatever, because the store does not offer a refund or an exchange. So I was like, I really don't feel like going back or anything and I'm just gonna like leave it alone and like I don't want to deal with it anymore, it's fine, it's over. So I ended up not going back to the store to check it out. The next day, I had other stuff that came up. I just remember the glasses online at other stores, they just did not have the nose pads that I saw at the store. So I realized basically that they kind of scammed me. Everything else was the same from color, from jewels, except one small detail. That's pretty huge for me since I wanted glasses with those nose pads so they would not keep falling off my face. And I was so pissed off because they showed me glasses with the nose pads. The same glasses. Same glasses. But it had those nose pads on them. And they showed it to me at the store, but I ended up getting a different pair of glasses that didn't have the nose pad. Like, everything else was the same except the nose pads. So I'm extremely mad that they basically, like, scammed me because they showed me a pair of glasses at the store, but I got a different pair. And that pair of glasses that they showed me at the store is basically, like, you know, for try-ons and all that. In the future, I can always get another pair and all that does have, like, those nose pads on it. Comment down below and all if you guys can relate if you're, like, Asian and you have have like no nose bridge and you wear glasses and all how do you deal with that Tiffany and Co so 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 beautiful oh excuse me okay so first I'm gonna be showing you the case first look at how freaking gorgeous this is oh my god so pretty I love it let me show you I'm gonna need to like hurry this up. I don't know if I can, I don't know if it's in focus that much. Like I don't have my glasses on. You guys can see like Tiffany and Co and like the jewelry. Oh my God, the jewels on the side, they are so gorgeous. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna hurry this video up. So inside just like a bunch of other stuff. My video is gonna die soon. I think another cloth, this is like a bag. Inside here is just basically like saying how this product is authentic. Anyway, I think that's about it. And I'm super, super happy with my new glasses. I'm gonna start wearing them now that I filmed this video and all. I kind of just wanted this video to be filmed and then so I can wear it and all. Cause you know, I don't know. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really have to go because my battery is gonna die. If you did like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and stay subscribed to my channel. So I will see you guys next time. Bye guys. Mwah. Thank you.